Thailand, the guy. Yo, guys, it is so hot. It's so hot. I was actually wearing a top on top of this, ne? but I could not be bothered. Okay, I could not be bothered. Um, today is the first day of October, and you know that uh, when I'm in here, I'm doing my makeup because Gips is about to hit the streets. Okay. <laughs> That's not me. That's not my life. But I am. I'm actually going on a little excursion. I'm not going on a little excursion. I'm going for vibes, food, drinks, uh, music, people. Uh, I'm going to... I've opened my windows, everything. So if you hear doors creaking, don't worry. It's just because I closed that door and I didn't hook it all the way in. Anyway, if it irritates me, I'll get up. So anyway, yeah, going to Opulent Saturdays with the girls. The girls being Bells and Prue. And uh, uh, we are, they're going to be arriving here at past 11. So I've got about half an hour. I've already done my hair, as you can see the white. I've done my hair, it'll dry. I've done my hair except the gel part, which I'll do after I do my makeup. And then, um, <laughs> Katla was going to be wearing all black today. And it's hot AF, okay? I'm going to be wearing a black Zara bodysuit. My black faux leather pants from, uh, H.O. Zara. Yo, I'll be in Zara all the way. So I'm going to be in Zara, Zara top bottom and then shoes are going to be my Castello King of Love sneakers I'll show you I couldn't decide whether I wanted to wear the goose at the back the Gucci sneakers or the Castello ones but I feel like the Castello ones are, are such a vibe and I'll show you why I say that um I did wow I'm sorry I did also want to maybe possibly pair them with uh, my partner bought me a pair of diesel sneakers last weekend and that's why I call him Mr. Diesel now. Uh, and uh, I wanted to pay, but the pink, it's like a white and pink. I'll show you. If I have time, I'll show you today. If I don't have time, I'll show you tomorrow. Um, but yeah, they just, they're just not going. They're just not going. The black is, the pink and the white is not necessarily going with the black. Uh, really, really looking forward to it. It it really happened very weirdly because Prue, uh, her very good friend, is one of the organizers, the one half of the organizers of Opulent, and Prue was just like, nah, bro, I wanna go, I wanna go, Ugh, lip sperm. So Prue was like, nah, bro, I wanna go, bro, I wanna go. So I was just like, hey, okay, okay, my son being gay. So she did what friends do and she bought me a ticket and I was like, I me a ticket. So what we do is we cover um, certain parts of the day, right? So they are going to be coming here because we're going to be using an Uber. Because uh, it's not far, it's about 10 minutes from me. And um, we're going to be using an Uber and then they're going to crash here for the evening. And then Prue was actually, at, she was ready to even book us a place to stay for the evening because she didn't want us driving. Um, but no, we're going to use an Uber and then we are going to come back later. Uh, Vlogtober, let's talk about it. So for me, I'm, I'm not going to do, I, I'll, I'll, I'll partake in Vlogtober, but in my own way. In the sense that I'm going to do it exactly how I did it last year. My ears are... My sinuses are wilding now that we're in spring. Yo! Um, so I'm going to do Vlogtober the way I did it last year. Okay, so I will, tr uh, what I can commit to, I think would be saying I will do three videos a week. If you get a fourth one, I already do three videos a week, right? If you get a fourth one, you lucky buggers. <laughs> if you get a fourth one, it's a bonus, but I'm not going to overly commit myself to anything more than what I do already produce. Um, there's So I, ca I go to work during the week, so I can't really even say that I have specific content planned, but 
I will definitely try to have specific content planned for the weekends. So my Vlogtober won't just be vlogs right through. Um, I'll do it as I say, like I did it last year, where I had sit down videos and vlogs. I just gave you three to four videos on my two. Wow, that's, those are nicely done brows. They're actually quite similar. They're not twins. They're not identical twins, but they're sisters, I think. They're close enough to being sisters. So that's what I will do for Vlogtober. Uh, just to catch you up on what has been going on this week, because I started this vlog quite late. I have been so busy this week. Uploading content, going to work, just being a creator. Okay, this week I've been so, 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 so busy. But uh, I uploaded my uh, Roast the Creators video. And I love the fact that I came up with this concept. It makes me feel so special. Um, but it's received quite well. And shame, I hope that my personality shines through in the video and people don't think that I'm mad or anything like that. Because I'm not. You'd know if I'm mad. I was actually quite enjoying it. We're going to use Huda today because we want a bitch to stay on all day. Okay? We don't want problems. Shucks. The bag that I'm carrying is so small. How am I even going to... I need to... How am I going to fit a powder in there or a brush? Oh, goodness. Okay. I'll have to figure it out. I don't know. But we're using Huda today because uh, we don't want problems. We want this this baby to stay on all day all day okay um so yeah that's how i will roll with vlogtober and i will try my level best to also put in a video or bonus vlog in the membership space as well weekly normally i do it every um bi-weekly uh but i'll really really try to do it weekly if i can I'm about to put on some foundation. We, we're going with Huda today. Please don't do that. Don't scare me like that. Especially not after I watch Jeffrey Dahmer. Please. Sure. I'm not even finished. So just to give you an update on the week. That's pretty much what's been going on. I've been going to work. Busy. Living life. Doing things. Uh, last weekend I... My partner purchased the sneakers for me. We were out, purchased the sneakers for me. And then I uh, got a pair of Ray-Ban sunglasses. Just, just. And I got the Apple Watch. You guys know. You guys know. Yeah. And then this week, yesterday, I took myself out on a solo date. Yesterday was Friday. I took myself out on a solo date where in the afternoon, I went to go watch at around 5 I went to New Metro and I went to go watch um, The Woman King. And I was so excited. And let me tell you, I cried. I don't remember the last time I left a movie house feeling so inspired, feeling so proud to be a woman. But not only that, to, just proud to be African. And, um, yo, man, it was just so beautiful. I loved it. I absolutely loved it. And I'm definitely going to watch it again if i wasn't busy tomorrow with the book club uh, virtual review i was gonna watch it tomorrow i was literally gonna go watch it tomorrow sorry and uh lining the lips before we follow with the girly so because i'm going to be in all black I really like pops of color here and there, and my lips is one of them, especially when I'm wearing black and I, I'm going to be going out. My lips must pop. Hey, so we're in the boudoir, ne? and then I just wanted to show you the bag that I'll be using is this one from uh, Luella, um, and Luella is... It's a Foshini brand. It's a TGF brand. And uh, yeah, really like it. It's tiny. It's cute. It's going to fit my house keys in there. My purse, which is where? Downstairs. Whew, my purse, which is downstairs. And my lip stuff. We've got sanitizer, T 
tissues because you know sometimes even though we're going to a hotel today but you know sometimes tissue right uh for the hands definitely pods in there these just in case i'm feeling kind of iffy down there uh -huh, just in case so that's this is where we act today with the bag and then shades these are the shades these are the babies these are the babies look at these Zink and zing, zink and zing, zing. How cute are those? Right? How cute are they? Ish, I forgot what they call them. Wait. They call them the what what? I forgot what they call them. Ah, guys, I don't even want to lie. I forgot what they call them. All I know is that they, they hold. They hold. Okay. And then, I'm going to have to take this off. But that's fine and then we have the zara bodysuit that i have i've always spoken about this bodysuit so we're gonna wear that and then these are the faux leather pants these are the zara pants i'm sure you've seen me in these pants in many a picture either on instagram or wherever uh but now i need to i need to do my where's my phone because if my friends call and they're in the gate i'm in trouble I'm in trouble. Okay, now I need to do my. Okay. Oh, it's knocking. No, no, so I just pretty much I lay them just like that. You see? You see? Lay the babies. Lay the babies down. But yeah, I shall, my friends can come now that I'm pretty much dressed. You can come in actual fact I'm thinking of going downstairs to have a savanna. I think we should do that because I'm actually partaking in October. I don't want to make a noise because my neighbors are outside. But I'm in my damn house, ain't I? See? See, how did I know that one of my friends would be at the gate? Hey, man. I'm good, man. What's going on? Nah, uh nothing, my Jay. Uh huh. Uh, no, I've been thinking about you since the day I saw you. Really? Uh, especially. Mm -hmm. So, I was talking to my brother. That was my brother on the phone. That was my brother. But anyway, <laughs> while I'm waiting for the girlies, I just washed my hands and now they're so dry. I always make sure that there's a. Uh, I always make sure there's uh what do you call the stuff everywhere in the house just in case i need it so in the meantime while i wait for the girlies me i'm going to drink my savanna and uh, enjoy yeah, mm. 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 savannah you're gonna savannah savannah get today okay Hi, hi, see fun. Oh, and I think actually my sister is also, uh, my sister also might be going to Opulent today. So, you know how I do. I'm going to leave my camera. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to leave my camera and then I'm going to vlog from my phone. Um, going to be wearing a little bit of jewelry. You'll see, you'll see. I'm going to have to take this off when I wear the, <sighs> what's this? Yeah, when I wear that thing. Uh, but I've, I I need to call my partner now. And then... Um, hopefully he's going to answer the phone. Because he's he been weird today. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
let me tell you if I can tell you one thing. Ah, two, two, maybe three things. First thing, my voice pretty much gone, okay? Um, today it's actually even better because I, I've just come back from work, by the way. No, I came back from work about an hour or so ago, and then I unpacked everything, as you saw, made myself a smoothie. Um, so over the weekend, I went to, on Saturday, I went to Opulent Sunday with uh, Opulent Saturday with uh, my friends in Bali and Prue and my sister slash friend, uh, La Lady. And we had a great time. It was so great. You know, when you have those memories where they, they are so sensitive, there's people's personal stories that you actually can't even share them online. We can't share them with everybody, like it's people's stories when they go out and have a good time and whatever, and you're their friend and they want you to keep it like that, keep keep their business to yourself, you know what I'm saying? So anyway, uh, we had a really good time and then last night my partner came over, last, yeah, yesterday in the afternoon, yesterday was Sunday, yesterday in the afternoon he came over and we went out for dinner and I called that dinner on Instagram, I called it the Lost Supper because I am partaking in October. So I'm actually starting October on the 3rd of October because we had just come from the weekend and I wasn't gonna go out and have a good time with my mates and not have a drink. So today is actually day one of October and that's fine. I mean, I don't drink every day. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. Uh, but for now, it is so incredibly hot. Let me just take out a kombucha or something because the one that sounds most refreshing is this one right now. This is kombucha. This is the uplift kombucha. And this is ginger lemon. So I'm going to be tasting it for the first time. I bought them a while ago um, and I actually haven't even had one of them. So I'm going to taste them low in sugar <laughs> i'm expecting no sugar okay and it's got live probiotic cultures which is great that actually reminds me i also need to take my probiotic now but anyway mm. it tastes like stony it tastes like ginger beer it actually tastes like stony just with a lot less flavor <laughs> But it's refreshing. It's kombucha. And for kombucha, this one is one of the better tasting ones. Kombuchas, <laughs> some of them are real bad. Real, real bad. But this one is, is pretty good. I not enjoy it. I wanted to show you this. I picked this up from Pip a week ago. And I haven't had the time to unpack it. And because now I don't have power, I've got time to unpack everything that I've picked up and put in the corner of my house to show you in the vlog. Now, I'm trying to get rid of these. I'm trying to do away with plastic. Oh, that's the meat that I cooked early on, but I'm trying to do away with plastic Tupperwares. Now, the ones that I do have that are glass are slightly smaller. Um, so I was in Pep the other day. I don't even remember why I went in there. I think I was just browsing around and I came across these. And I thought to myself, because I'm on the path, I've got so many Tupperwares. And I do not want to follow the, the trajectory of our parents, where they just buy and buy Tupperwares for no good reason. No, I'm not trying to do that. However, um, we do put food away into the fridge and we warm food up and all of that. And as you know, my kitchen has uh, wooden accents all over the kitchen. So, like for instance, right? There's like wood all over the kitchen. So like for instance, <laughs> right? There's like wood everywhere. So I came across these and I'm someone who cooks and I store food obviously in Tupperware containers. So I came across these. The only difference is glass. And I absolutely love them because they've got a wooden top. Am I happy about it? Yes, and it just slides in like that. You can open it, slides in like that. I love that. And especially for days where um, I'll also go to work or I, I like to take snacks when I'm driving. Like if I'm driving to my partner's house, I'll take grapes and strawberries or something. Um, and then I'll put them in and I'll snack on them when I'm driving. 
So these are great. And I got three different types, three different sizes. Oops. Three different sizes and two of each size. So these two are one size. Trust me, I'm going to wash them. I'm not going to just put them away. These are one size. And then these are the ones that are great for work. This is the smallest size. For me, this is fantastic. I actually like eating out of, as you can see. Check the difference between the two. There you go. Um, I actually like eating out of these, especially when I'm having things like stir fry or eggs or I don't know. Meat. So this is the other size. There we go. I absolutely love them. I think they're gorgeous. I really think they are stunning, and this is the biggest size. So. That's a bigger, that's medium, and the one I showed you before is the small. I might be sounding kind of funny, but it's because, it's because, like I said, um, I'm not feeling the best. And I'm going to slowly get rid of these. I'm going to slowly phase these out, except to keep a few of them. Um, but the older ones, I'm going to phase them out, give them to friends, family. I don't know. But I'll figure it out. Let me go switch that off. And then I have something else to show you. So we'd have to sit down and talk about that too. about to chat to you guys but now I need to go to my gate I'm looking kind of crusty it's Friday uh, I'm going to an event today it's gonna to be a rather busy weekend um, but that event and the weekend will be part of the next vlog um, so I'm gonna finish off this part of the vlog now um, I need to go to the gate <laughs> so I had to go open the gate for Tandy um, but i am gonna close this vlog here i actually don't even know what footage content i have for you guys uh but this is pretty much the last bit of this particular vlog might not be the most interesting one but uh, there's interesting things happening this weekend um but in this vlog you will have seen uh when i went to opulent with the friends with the girls I think I was recording on that day before I left and I'll put in, I'll have probably put in some footage from there. We had such a great time. We had such a great time. Uh, but the, the, oh my gosh, but the following day, the two girls were a mess. Mbali and Prue were a mess. Uh, they had gone through it. Uh, but um, yeah, that's what happens when you get older, you know, we don't party as much as Abunaled party. Um, because we just don't recover the same, like it's, we just don't recover the same. <laughs> anyway, so these boxes from Take A Lot have been sitting in my house downstairs for a while and it's only now that I'm actually getting a chance to uh, open them because I tend to do that. Can I be useless in Yana ways because I just get stuff and then they sit in the house for weeks on end before I unbox them. So anyway, uh, for the Sony on my M50, 
I record my sit down videos with my M50 and this is what we are using now is the Sony and the Sony does come with like a, a muffler uh, for wind what what um, and I'm quite happy with it having used it I'm gonna use it again today at the event that's why I need to stop this vlog now so that I can charge the camera uh, so that it's fully ready for the event and I need to transfer the I need to transfer the footage that's on there onto my laptop so I can format the card anyway so on my m50 i use this mic um i think a lot of creators a lot of creators use this mic this is the boya uh cardioid microphone <coughs> which works really well with computers tablets cameras phones all of that it's just great for um cancellation of noise and and wind and just outside sounds especially when you're recording outside um it's just slightly bigger and uh, i prefer the one on the sony to be honest but we'll see we'll see and then um in terms of my sit down videos i want to try out using this the um lavalier microphone the one that you pretty much stick into your uh, clothes um that's what i want to um start using trying it and seeing how the sound how different the sound is going to be um so uh, it's kind of exciting so it's also from the same brand it's also from boya so they're both from boya and they're very reasonably priced so if you're wondering uh, this one i think is about 200 odd and then this one owami what what that's a oh, wami want now? No, I'm kidding. Um so 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 and then there's uh uh what what was I saying? Yeah, and then this one is about 300 400 So they're really not that bad. Uh if you're somebody who's looking for new stuff. And then I got new books. Um I'm still I'm moving very slowly through um woman eating and it's not because i don't like it i actually really enjoy it it's just because i'm doing vlogtober right so i'm putting up a video every other day i can't do every day so i'm putting up a video every other day and uh i just don't have time to read i'm constantly editing and like right now i've got uh let me check i've got i think think four videos um four videos that are just waiting to be published they're sitting on my uh in my dashboard um in my in my youtube studio and there's four of them that are just waiting to be published one is going to go up today and then yesterday i recorded five other videos and then there's also editing this so i really just don't have time to read but um i will read i'll make time this weekend it's going to be a relatively quiet weekend well saturday it's going to be a relatively quiet saturday um and then sunday today is busy and sunday is busy so huh, but i am listening to a book every single time i'm driving and the book that i'm listening to is this one this is um tell me this is the book that i'm listening to tell me lies by carola lovering and if ever i hated a character this woman carola lovering carola or carola carola Lover, lovering wow it's weird name weird spelling but anyway carola lovering did a really good job of creating two very unlikable characters this is a book about um that follows a girl called lucy and lucy is just she's you know she comes lucy just screams white privilege to me and stephen so the book is split it's narrated pretty much by lucy and stephen interchangeably with each chapter and you kind of watch Lucy fall in love with Stephen, 
but Stephen is the most misogynistic, narcissistic, white privileged, un fucking yo. Like I hate him. He cheats on his girlfriends. He cheats on Lucy. They, so they are in uh, college, right? They in a really fancy uh, college, and they all have friends and this and that and the other. And you see parts from Lucy's side where she's talking about how she's met Stephen, she feels this way about Stephen, this, this, that, and the other. Then you read from Stephen's side where he's got Diane, who is his current girlfriend, but he cheats on her with Lucy. And it's just a mess. And Lucy falls in love with Stephen and finds out about Diane and then decides to, she wants to lose weight the skinnier she is, maybe the more, you know, Stephen will notice her. It's just, but it's so engrossing. Like, I feel like I'm going to rate it a good four out of five. At the rate that it's going, I think I'm going to rate it a good four out of five because Carola Lovering did a very good job of making unlikable characters. And she did, it's exceptional. It's, it screams white privilege, and I think that's exactly what you wanted to do, right? It screams white privilege. It screams just narciss narcissism and misogyny and, like, um, I'm from a wealthy family. I saw my mom do this and this, 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 the thing that I don't speak about. And it's just, oh, my God. But it's executed very well. Um, so... I can't wait to finish it. I can't wait to see what's going to happen and what, what. Um, also, another thing today is Dineo's birthday. Dineo, my best buddy. It's her birthday today. Unfortunately, I won't be able to see her because I have an event to go to, but that's fine. And um, I once, I met a girl a few weeks ago uh, at Life Grand in... Um, Life Grand in, what, what, what is it? Uh, Mall of the South, at Mall of the South. I was there with my partner and we were, oh my God, the sun ravaged me. Oh, that's, that's so bad. I was there with my partner and we were having dinner and um, Alyssa came up to me. I keep meeting Palissas. This is the weirdest thing, right? I've met probably like three Palissas in the last two months who just come up to me and said, hi, how are you, whatever. And so I wanted to greet Balissa because she said, please send me a shout out. So hey, Balissa, don't forget you, girl. Hey, girl. Hey. I need to be out of this house. I have a couple of things that I need to do so that I can come back um, and get my makeup on and go to this event. Okay? I have to be there at 3. I don't even know where it is. I think it's in 4 days. I think it's a prison break. Oh, it actually. Okay, I'll talk to you guys a little bit later. Okay? If I don't see you in the next video.